Good day, YouTubers. Welcome back to another video with the Electrical Guide. Today, I wanted to make just a quick video to show you what the various settings are on a standard meter. You can get a nicer meter than this, spend a few uh, a few more dollars, and you can definitely get a cheaper meter than this. This is about mid-grade. So let's just talk about what these various settings are. So turning this meter on is very easy. You just rotate the dial once and the meter turns on. Now that first setting is voltage, AC and DC. And you see that the DC underneath is in orange. So right now it's set to AC. You would press select and that's gonna change you to DC voltage reading. And we can go back. The next setting here is amperage, ampacity, AC. And you measure that with the clamp on here. You put your conductor in the clamp and it'll give you an opacity reading. Next one we have here is a few things. We've got resistance, and we've got the audible continuity, and we've also got diode readings here. And again, those are in orange, so you're pressing select. Just to scroll through the various readings here. Next we've got Hertz. Now in North America, we're going to read 60 Hertz. That's the standards. And we've also got duty cycle here as well in orange. Next, we've got capacitance. And that's the only one on this. After that, we've got temperature. Yes, this meter does temperature, Celsius or Fahrenheit. You'll need a couple more components uh, if you want to pull off the temperature reading. And then the last setting we have here is low impedance AC or DC. And then again, you're hitting select to scroll through, whether it be DC or AC readings. And those are the settings on a standard meter. Now you know what you're looking at when you buy your first meter, or maybe you were given a meter and you've got some of these settings. Hopefully I've covered the ones that are on your meter. These are the standard ones. Thanks for watching another video with the Electrical Guide. Be sure to like and subscribe if you appreciate the content.